Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu Friends, welcome to my channel Today I have this FM USB MP3 player It is not working So let's check it First of all open it by this screw Then lift this top cover Here I have this lock Pull back this lock here if it is in forward condition in this point at that time the ribbon cable will locked pull back it slide it back and then we can remove this ribbon cable and if we check here we have two capacitor covers here in the body 1000 microfarad 10 volt and we have two blast capacitor damaged capacitors here open these two screws for heat sink and audio connector then this screw It is a very simple car tape circuit. It is using YD1028 IC. It is two channel audio amplifier. So this circuit is just only two channel audio amplifier and these two capacitors, audio capacitors are damaged which are used to couple the speakers with this IC. So these two capacitors are damaged. So let's remove it. I removed this damaged capacitor it is 1000 microfarad 10 volts so we will replace these capacitors and these capacitors have just only two plates and dielectric paper so it is the total construction of the capacitor due to overheat due to leakage of the dielectric this capacitors damage when these damage its outer cover goes away now I replace these both damaged capacitors with this 16 volt capacitor with the same range so it has 16 volt original capacitor are 10 volt so it is in safe range we can use it now we have to power on this board if you don't have wiring diagram if you don't have a connector how we can power on let's check it it is a very easy way to find out the connections continuity locate the power capacitor the big one DC capacitor DC link positive line it is here this one is positive and the negative line this one is negative line positive negative so these two positive and negative capacitors and these negative lines are parallel to each other this negative in ground in and this is and these four terminals one two three four terminals for the speakers and these four terminals for the audio output for the speakers one two three four these four ground lines and these four audio lines because each two lines are in parallel so we have one speaker connection ground speaker connection ground speaker connection ground speaker ground here we have positive ground and this is accelerator now I have to connect the ground line here at the second pin which is connected directly to the negative side of the capacitor now I connected ground line at second pin this pin ground pin and this one is positive pin this pin is accelerator pin which is coming from the power switch ignition switch let's remove it that will more easy 
I removed this front panel so we can see the easily response of the circuit. Unlock this ribbon cable connector by pulling back this black retainer and now we have to insert this ribbon cable. Yes, now it is entered and it is locked. Power on. I have 12 volt external power ground and positive so it is powered on now we have to connect speakers so our power connections are good we have this negative line so these one two three four lines are ground lines so our this barbered wire with a black color this one is white and this one is white black so white black the black labeled wire will connect it to the negative side at this strip it is low side wire we can say it is speaker negative if we have four channel output then in that case there will be speaker positive and speaker negative and we will connect ground and this one is speaker positive for this side so here I am connecting black line red black to the negative line negative rail and this one will go to speaker positive where is speaker positive the track which is coming from these audio capacitors these capacitors after making connections now we will power on so it is it is powered on now we have to check it now it is the radio it is powered on now radio is working so we there was a problem just only these capacitors so now it is working now we can check uh, the auxiliary auxiliary input if that circuit is working or no set to auxiliary we have this input terminal for auxiliary input so we can connect it here this this line is okay and our touch a tweezer or anything so this speaker is off this track is working now and so we have both lines working here i hope so this video is informative if it is informative give a give a like thanks for watching assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh assalamu